Last time we have shown how to perform scalar multiplication efficiently. We have chosen a generator and by repeated doubling and adding of points, we have calculated the 13th multiply of this generator point. But if we choose a point on the elliptic curve in simple Weierstrass form, be it over a finite field or real numbers, there is no easy way to tell how many times we need to multiply a given generator to get the chosen point. The only known algorithm uses the naive approach of consecutively adding the generator to itself until the chosen point is found. On average, this algorithm must traverse about half of the rational points of the elliptic curve before finding the chosen point. This is called the elliptic curve discrete logarithm problem and the security of elliptic curve cryptography is based upon the toughness of solving this problem. So it is 5 operations to reach the point 13G and 12 operations to reveal how we got there in this case. Generally speaking, the number of operations required to perform the scalar multiplication using the double and add algorithm rises with a logarithm of the scalar number. However, the number of steps to reverse this operation grows linearly with the possible scalar sizes. And no feasible approach to reverse the scalar multiplication is known. Thank you for watching and consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and following us on Twitter.